All right, we've got a tech genius on the uh, air with us this morning. And it ain't me, that's for sure. <laughs> the uh, the founder of Foursquare, a uh, revolutionary uh, app that uh, people have been using for years, uh, Dennis Crowley is joining us. Hello, Dennis. Hey, how are you guys doing? Thanks for having me on the show. Uh, we appreciate you uh, calling in this morning. Now, you, you're the co-founder of uh, Foursquare, which, uh, for people that don't know, you were at the forefront of the, uh, really, a lot of this uh, mobile technology about, about, like, checking in. Like where you go, people take it for mm-hmm. granted now. They can, you know, they go to the store, they check in that they were at places and stuff. But you guys were the first, right? Yeah, we were the first. This is this is actually my second company. I had a company before this that we we sold it to Google, and then we made another company called Foursquare that was doing, um, you know, check ins and kind of awareness of where your friends are and being able to tag yourself to certain locations. But yeah, it's something that we invented, you know, about ten years ago. So now. You are you're like you were from Massachusetts, right? You're like a uh, you're a, mm-hmm. a northeast guy. How did you wind up uh, here in the Hudson Valley? Because you live here now, right? Yeah, my, well, my wife and I are still going back and forth between New York and uh, and Kingston. We have a house just out, outside of Kingston, and you know we're doing that that thing where we start. You know, you start with the weekend, then you add a Friday, then you try to add a Friday and a Monday. Mm-hmm. So we're in that in that transition. I, I, a lot of people know it well. Um, you know, I went, I went to school up in Syracuse and then, um, you know, my wife and I got married, uh, in Milton and we spent a lot of time in the Hudson Valley trying to figure out a place to get married. And we just had this moment of like, why don't we just live up here? This is so much better than being in the city. And, uh, yeah, we're, we're about four years into that journey of trying to figure out how to do that full time. So, I mean, most people who are like in the, the tech industry and stuff, they're all out in Silicon Valley and, you know, they set up shop out there. Has it has it been difficult to be here out on the East Coast and, and still doing all this stuff? Um, not so much now, but like when we started the company what was it, eight or nine years ago, people thought that we were crazy for trying to do a tech company in New York. And people would say, like, why don't you do it in San Francisco? And our answer was always, well, we, we live in New York, so we're going to do it in New York. <laughs> that's, that's cool. And, you know, it was crazy in 2009, but now there's a really booming tech ecosystem in the city. Well, the reason why I want to talk to you this morning is because, you know, I was on Twitter the other day, and uh, this ad pops up, uh, you know, this, this thing. And it's, uh, it's actually a message from you uh, looking for uh, people here in the Hudson Valley who are in the tech field because you're considering – uh, setting up shop right here in in the Hudson Valley is that right? Yeah, yeah. We um, it's very hard to hire great engineers no matter where you are in San Francisco or in New York. And you know, we're having a discussion about it as a in, uh, at one of our board meetings. Like we should we need to open another engineering office. And as we're, I'm sitting there listening to the discussion, people say we should do it in Atlanta, or we should do it in North Carolina, or we should do it in Toronto. And then I raised my hand and I said, like, why don't we try to do it in the in the Hudson Valley? Um, there's a lot of talent up there. There's a lot of great energy. It's close to the city. Um, you know, there, there, there isn't, you know, one, uh, there isn't a whole bunch of, you know, tech companies from the city that have put a flag up there and said, we're going to try to do it here. And they said, why don't we, why don't we try it? And, um, you know, as part of that, what, what we were trying to do is go out and collect resumes from software engineers, um, that have some experience that are really talented, uh, just to really suss out the level of interest and to make sure that the people that are interested match you know, the skill sets that we have. But it's certainly something that we would love to be able to pull off. It, it, would they be working for, like, this Foursquare thing, or are you planning on something new? Oh, no, it would be it would be Foursquare. The idea would be to create a remote engineering office um, of maybe five people or maybe ten people and put it, um, you know, put it somewhere in the Hudson Valley. It could be Kingston. It could be Poughkeepsie. It would depend on, you know, where... The people that are interested in this, like, where do they live right now and what's easy for them? So what has the response been so far from the Hudson Valley? Uh, it's been great. Like, I gave, um, there's, there's a thing called the Hudson Valley Tech Meetup, and it bounces, it, you know, it's a meetup of 200, 250 people that show up about every month and that are all doing technology or doing startups in the in the area. Uh it was in Kingston last, um, what was it, last week or two weeks ago. And so I gave a quick talk there and, and talked about it, and, and people are excited. The response online has been, has been great, and we've been starting to collect resumes, and some of them are looking pretty great. So we're really excited about that. Well, I think it'd be a, it would be a great thing for our area. And uh, look, I'm not the, uh, I'm not the uh, smartest guy in the world. I'm probably not going to be able to join Foursquare, but I'm definitely in your corner. <laughs> and I'm excited about this possibly happening. And but he could check in a lot of places. I, I'll check in. I'll be the mayor <laughs> of wherever you want me to be. Uh, but now, yeah, there you go, right? <laughs> what, what a lot of people don't know, though, maybe about you too, is that you're actually the, uh, the driving force 
behind uh, the the soccer club up in Kingston, right? The stockade. Yeah, yeah, that was just um, a project that we started on the side because um, you know I felt that there's so there's just so much awesome stuff that's going on in Kingston. Just really good creative energy and people just building the things that they want to build. And uh, we wanted to do something like that, too. And, you know, the soccer club, which is seeing some great success recently, like we just won a huge trophy. We won a conference champions. It's great. Um, I mean, that was a crazy idea two years ago. And people said it will never work and it's never going to happen. And I said, well, why don't we just try it? Let's see what happens. And people love it. You know, there's 1,400 people at the last home. Wow. Yeah, and so I kind of think of... Like, you know, everyone said that was kind of, everyone said Foursquare was kind of a crazy idea that would never work. And everyone said that the you know soccer team was a crazy idea that would never work. And everyone says that the <laughs> Foursquare Hudson Valley engineering office is a crazy <laughs> idea that's never going to work. And I'm like, I think there's something something to these crazy ideas, and I think that they, they can work. So we should at least give them a shot. Well, we love the fact that you're up here in the Hudson Valley and that you're uh, giving back to the community so much. So we appreciate you taking time to talk to us this morning. And keep us posted on this uh, new Hudson Valley uh, you know, office. We'd love to uh, you know, let people know what's going on. Yeah, I'd, um, you know, if there's anyone that's listening that's interested, feel free to reach out to me. I, like I have a, I'm trying to think of the best URL I can point you towards. Uh, but there's, I wrote a blog post about this, and it's on a, a website called Medium. Well, I'll tell you what, you, you can go to, we, we've got a website. Oh, go I know, I know you, you want to promote all your stuff. I'm going to promote our website. we got WPDH.com. I'm going to put all the details there. Any way uh, people can reach out to you. Uh, and that way, uh, oh, that's if, great. If Fantastic. We, have, we have any tech people that are out there that are interested in uh, getting in contact with you, uh, we'll have all the details up on our website. Oh, that's perfect. Thank you so much. And thanks for letting me come on the show and talk about this. It's important that we get the word out because it's the best way to you know, get the best candidates interested. Absolutely. And uh, next time you're in the area, stop on by. We'd love to hang out with you. Yeah, that'd be great. All right. Thanks, Dennis. I appreciate it. All right, guys. Thank you again. See you. Thank you.